In chapter 9 of Getting to Know ArcGIS Desktop for 9.3, we will be looking at joining and relating tables. More specifically, in exercise 9a, we will be joining these tables. Go ahead and open your data for of exercise 9a. Now you see departure from the previous chapter. Now we're looking at, um, at uh, Louisiana. More specifically, some of the uh, wells, also known as pits, in, in the state of Louisiana in the United States. So the first step is we want to go to the bookmark of southern Louisiana where these pits are located. Um, and we'll take a look at one of the uh, layers, which is called Pit 75. Pit 75, you see uh, different, different data for these uh, different pits. There are points, as you can see here, there are points. Uh, they have an ID number, the well number, a pit type, status, which parish or also county it's in, if it has a containment, uh, etc. But what is missing is data on what we need to do if we need to be repaired at uh, these pits. And this is data that someone has gone out and, um, and, and gotten for us. And that's in a different table. Go ahead and, and add data. And we want to have data in chapter 9. Uh, data, and it's called Remedial Actions. It's DBF. That's a database. Go ahead and add that. Make sure you're in the Source tab, uh, not in the Display tab. It won't show because you haven't, you're not displaying it. It's not a, uh, it's not a layer. It's just, it's just a data table. It's a database. So in the source, let's take a look at what's in this uh, database. Okay. Here you see uh, the same ID number uh, that was in the other table. We can go ahead and, um, and freeze the column. And that way, if, for example, it doesn't all fit on your screen, you can scroll to the right and the ID number stays the same. As you see, some of these, um, the cleanup is... Um, I wish to submit plan for cleanup. It's a monitor site, uh, repair or removal of structure. Uh, there, there are different classifications for each table, and we we want these two tables, namely uh, this attributes of remedial actions table and the pit 75 table. We want them to be in the same table, not in two two tables, but in one table. So how do you do that? Go ahead and close the attributes of remediable actions. Go to PITS 75, right click, go to Joins and Relate, and Join. So now, make sure you want you have join attributes from a table selected. There uh, is another one, but we don't want to do spatial location. We want it to do from a table. Specifically, we want the ID number to be used in the relation um, and then we're using the remedial actions table this one to relate and also the ID number make sure that you keep all records uh, like that and click OK sometimes you'll get a dialog of um, uh, should build an index go ahead and click yes if you see that if you see that um, message appear now we're finished. We can go to the PIT75 table and see what happened. Okay. It may not be obvious at first, but now all this data is uh, in one table. Two tables are joined into one. How can we see that? Well, everything beginning from here, you see ID number with a star. That's the same ID number that we use to relate and the rest of the columns to the right of the ID number are from the remedial actions database and you can see that if you turn off let's see the field aliases now the full names of uh, of the fields are shown so this is the access land from the remedial actions table and this is the access to water from the remedial actions table We'll go ahead and aliases are there for a reason. 
because it makes it more easy to to read. Okay, so back to what we're getting at is the cleanup. Some of these uh, have not been monitored. Some of them need to be cleaned up. Others just need to be monitored. And, well, we want to use, use this table for our symbology so that you can see it on, on our map. Well, you, know, we should, you should know how, what, to be, what we're doing now. Namely, we go back to Pits 75, double click, and symbology. We want to do it by category, uh, unique values. And this time, instead of ID number, we want to use cleanup as our symbology had all the values. So as you see, we have uh, different types of um, cleanup procedures for the pits in southern Louisiana. Uh, we want to change the symbology uh, for all the symbols. Go ahead and do symbol 2. We'll use the size 8 and click OK. Now yeah, obviously we don't want uh, them all to be green, so we use basic random and then click OK. Now, now we have uh, have joined two tables, uh, the PIT 75, which is the table we started with. We've added all of the remedial actions for the PITs, and then we symbolized all of the um, PITs as to what needs to happen to them. So, and for example, repair of repair or removal of structures. All of those are located in the southeast of Louisiana. And that's it for exercise 8, I'm sorry, exercise 9A. Um, if you are continuing, save your data and move on to 9B.